Yeah, yeah viewers so I just realised something. Every single aftermarket iPhone 5 uh, lightning charger I've bought, all the non-genuine non ones, they're not magnetic. And they're also crap. You gotta buy a genuine if you buy on a lightning connector. I've had a lot of problems with not original um, Apple certified lightning chargers. They are a pain in the ass. A genuine one is the only one that's magnetic. So there you go. If you buy one that you think it's genuine and you want to make and you want to know for sure if it's a genuine charger or a lead, look at how this is recessed in there. That's one way to tell. But that's not always true because this thing also has a recessed in there as well. Looks just like the Apple one. A real way to tell is to get to your end. If it's magnetic, it's a genuine Apple one. That's something I didn't know. I just that was just, just um, an accident. I discovered this. And also a lot of the cheap ones, I had a real cheap um, flat flex style uh, Apple charger. The uh, metal sides here on this side and that side are actually separated from the plastic part. So you, yeah, you do got to be careful what you buy. Always buy the genuine ones. And I'll put duct tape around here and uh, super glue because the uh, outer sheathing tears away on the genuine Apple chargers. As you can see here it's starting to bulge. So yeah. They're expensive, the genuine Apple ones are bastards. But they're the only ones that work properly. Also looking here. I should say here anyway if it's genuine. But yeah, this is just a little... Uh, I thought this was quite interesting. They're the only ones that are magnetic. Ah, get our view as well. Caravan's been sold. Big empty space here now. Put it on for about a day and someone snapped it up just like that. It's all been cleaned out. I washed it, hosed it all down and give it a good scrub. Made it look really pretty. So uh, they're going to use it for camping. So. Looks so much bigger than it here. It was good times when I had the man cave. Mm, missing it already, but oh, well, I went to a good home. And a big bloody raining yesterday too. Bloody pouring yesterday, I got bloody 50 mil of rain. What a big flood. Anyway, nothing else can happen. The uh, camera really does not detect light very good. I can, I can still see heaps of stuff here at this time of the day, but this camera, no. Nah. It's absolutely crap at seeing in the dark. You won't be able to see this, but we're keeping the uh, Lincoln own hand motor generator. We're keeping this, so this will be put away out of our dad's cousin's house. Real handy. Anyway. No more man cave here. Thanks for watching.